that at one time you hear the song of the horn, flute, harp, sackbut, psaltery, and dulcimer, and all kinds of music, ye fall down and worship the image which I have made. Well, but if you worship not, you shall be cast the same hour into the midst of a burning fiery furnace. And who is that God that shall deliver you out of my hands? Shall drunk Mejak and a bed be go answer and said to the king, O Nebuchadnezzar, be and not careful to answer me in this matter. If it be so, our God whom we serve is able to deliver us from the burning fiery furnace. And he will deliver us out of thy hand, O king. But if not be it known unto thee, O king, that we will not serve thy God, nor worship the golden image which thou hast said. Then was Nebuchadnezzar full of fury, and the form of his visage was changed against Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Therefore he spake and commanded that they should sweep the pudding one seven times more than it was one to be heated. And he commanded the most mighty men that were in his army to bind Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego and to cast them into the burning fiery furnace. Then these men were bound in their coats, their horses, and their hats, and their other garments, and were cast into the midst of the burning fiery furnace. Therefore, because the king's commandment was urgent, and the furnace exceeding hot, the flame of the fire slew those men. Of King Strong Oya Kim in Judah. 
our reference can be taken from Ephesians chapter 6. Thank you. 
One day we will be able to look death in the face and say, Oh death, where is thy sting? And oh grave, where is thy victory? Hallelujah. Verse 20 to 22 speaks about a burning, fiery furnace. And verse, hallelujah, hallelujah, it also refers to verse 17 and 18. Today I want to remind God's people that our God whom we serve is able to deliver us from not only, hallelujah, all evil. Jesus' name. 